Call the public hearing to order the notice of public hearing. Inclusion of a parcel into the agricultural district number two. Is there any public comment? For those on the line, this is a public hearing for the notice uh, or for the inclusion of a parse of parcels into agricultural district number two. Oh, Public comment. <coughs> Mayor Peelers, um, we're, we just closed the public hearing. The regular meeting will start in four minutes. Okay, I'm sorry. Thank you. Legislator Duchesne. Present. Legislator Peck. Present. 
Okay, I just wanted to say that yesterday, November 23rd, was National Public Health Thank You Day. I think it is safe to say that Montgomery County legislature, legislators are all grateful for our public health staff. This year, COVID has definitely increased the workload for our public health team. I want to take a minute to thank our Montgomery County public health staff for their dedication to making the community safer and healthier. We appreciate you and your work has not gone unnoticed. Thank you again for all that you do. Thank you. Does anyone else have a comment? Uh, Okay, and we'll couple of close the public comment portion. Any communications? I do not. We're well, using the glasses now. <laughs> okay, all right. Do I have a sponsor for approval of the minutes? I'll, I'll second it, Mr. Chair. Okay, Mike. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Okay, we will, uh, let's see, acceptance of the budgetary transfers. Do I have a sponsor? I'll sponsor. Dan? Anyone else? I'll second. Robert? All in favor? All right, Aye. Aye. Any opposed? Any abstentions? Yes. And we have the acceptance of the procurement record. Do I have a sponsor for that? I'll move it. Okay, thank you. Second. <coughs> Second. Okay. Thank you, Bob. All in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Any abstentions? Yes. Moving on to our new business, and that's all for business. I'm sorry, old business, I'm sorry. All right. And I have a line item veto, which I have in front of me for a resolution of line 9 of 2020. Is there any discussion on that? Does anyone wish to bring it up again? Okay, resolution number 190, resolution establishing negative declaration and seek for determination for partial inclusion into agricultural district number two. It was sponsored by Kelly and Thayer. Is there any discussion? Now, let's have a vote. All in favor? Aye. Aye. Anybody opposed? Any abstentions? Yes. Resolution number 191, resolution for property owner request to be included within Montgomery County Certified Agriculture District number two. And that was sponsored by Pep and Wilson. Is there any discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Any opposed? Any abstentions? Pass. Resolution number 192, uh, I'm sorry, and that's resolution authorizing the county executive to sign a renewal agreement 2021 with the transportation of Fulton County veterans. And that was sponsored by Thayer and Sweet. Is there any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Any opposed? Any abstentions? Yes. Resolution number 193, resolution authorizing the county executive to sign a renewal agreement with HM Life Insurance Company of New York. 
And that was sponsored by Mr. Heidel Jr. and Mr. Purcell. Is there any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Abstentions? Pass. Resolution number 194, resolution amending 2020 Delta Dental and Rule Agreement. That was sponsored by Mr. Purcell and Mr. Pepp. Is there any discussion on that? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Any abstentions? Pass. Resolution number 195, resolution adopting revised non-bargaining policy for full-time, part-time, appointed, and department heads. That was by Wilson and Thayer. Is there any discussion for that? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Any abstentions? Pass. Okay, and resolution number 196, resolution adopting introductory law H, local law 7 of 2020, a local law establishing salary schedule for various county officials. And that was sponsored by Mr. Pepp and Mr. Thayer. Is there any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Any abstentions? Pass. Okay, resolution number 197, resolution authorizing county treasurer to disperse mortgage tax money. And that was by Legislator Kelly and Legislator Hedwell, Jr. Is there any discussion on that? All in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Any abstentions? Pass. Resolution number 198, resolution approving abstract of audited claims, the county legislature by Mr. Kelly and Mr. Wilson. Is there any discussion on that? Any opposed? I'm sorry. I'll give her first. Okay. Anybody all in favor? Okay. Aye. Opposed? Any abstentions? Pass. Resolution number 199, bond resolution of the county of Montgomery, New York, dated November 24, 2020, authorizing the construction of a public works building. I'm sorry, public business and development and for the Department of Public Works and for business development. It was sponsored by Legislator Pepp and Legislator Hedwell, Jr. All in favor? Sorry, any discussion first? Go ahead, Mr. Duchesne. Yes, Mr. Chairman. I'm seeking some additional support for this project, in particular from those legislators who appear to have both sides of the issue when they voted against moving this to the full legislature. And I'm not willing to see both sides of an argument. There were some objections were that the building was too large, but that came without any explanation of what size the building should be. And then another explanation was that it cost too much. That came without a basis on which that determination was made. If you think something costs too much, you have to compare it to how much you think it should cost. So there was really no demonstration of how that conclusion was reached. If you really support the project, then you would be voting in the affirmative. So I think the need for this building has already been demonstrated. The costs have been justified for us. The size of the building is relatively, especially DPWs, very similar to what is already being used. So 
uh, I urge uh, those legislators who voted against bringing this to uh, to the full legislature to to uh, take pause and reconsider their position. Thank you, uh, Mr. Patel. Just to address Mr. Duchesne's comments, you know, I've had discussions with a lot of people about it, and had comparisons with several things, including the size of the emergency management building, which is actually a really good garage, and the cost of that would be $1.6 million, and the cost of the offices that we did for emergency management, which I believe were about four, four and a half million dollars. And if we looked at the, the square footage of both of those, comparison size, which even if you add 20% of it, brings you up to $7,200,000. I don't think there's anybody in the room that disagrees that we'd like to relocate EPW out of the floodplain. I don't think there's anybody in the room that doesn't agree that the building is over 50 years old and could use repairs. And I won't be reconsidering my vote. And the reasons that I'm not are because I don't think it's appropriate at this time to spend $13 million when the city of Amsterdam is picking up a good portion of the increases in our budget every year. They were the only places in the, the district, the only municipalities that picked up taxes. Sure, it was based on their um, assessments, but it still holds true that they picked up 8 and 9% of the tax increases in the city when, when, or in the county when no other villages or towns or districts picked up any. They actually saw a decrease. So my reason I'm voting no for it is be, just because of that. That I think that there is ways of reducing the cost of the building, not necessarily the size. There are ways of addressing the amenities that go along with it. And I, I don't want to see the city of Amsterdam seeing another 8 or 9 or 10 percent increase next year when it comes time to the budget. Okay, any other discussion here? Yes, Mr. Mr. Chairman. Um, in, in, in reply uh, to that last point in particular regarding the assessed value of the community, they're, they're linking um, our obligation to address this particular issue really is, is only tangentially related to, to the assessment in the city of Amsterdam, which is not this legislative body's responsibility. We don't, we don't do the assessments at and the city's failure to do reassessment on a, on a, on a regular basis um, goes all the way back to the, to the 90s that I can remember when I was in office. Um, so, so that linkage, I think, is, is inappropriate here. We need to make a determination of this project based on what, on what the project is and what the county's needs are. Call the roll. I know I'm not ready for that yet. Does the chairman have any insight? I can ask the call the roll. What's that? I can ask the call the roll. Call the question. Okay. That's what you do then. Okay. Roll call. Call the question. Okay. Do I have to vote? Do I do a roll call? Okay. Yeah. Now, what is the sign to them? What are we going to ask? Passing the word. I guess they need a resolution. So that, this is a resolution? Yes. All right. Okay. Legislator Pack. Yes. Chairman Isabel. Yes. Legislator Patel. No. Legislator Kelly. Yes. Legislator Sweet. No. Legislator Thayer. No. Legislator Headwell. Yes. Legislator Wilson. Yes. Legislator Duchesne. Yes. Resolution passes. Now that uh, that passes, now that Mr. Bertel has uh, shut off the discussion on it, I have a comment to say. 
Uh, I changed my opinion primarily because of the fact that no one was, was upset with spending a million dollars buying a building for the recorder for DSA. That really didn't need to be done. We need to get a safe, you know, what, what's the frown for? We didn't need to spend that money right now. We could have rented another building. But there were there were people pushing it and it got through. And my idea is that number two, you're gonna look at three or four million dollars to fix that building we're in right now. And just I just thought that that the money we wasted out of that building is the That's the way I feel. And is there any other discussion on this resolution? Motion to adjourn. I'll second the motion. Call the question. You stop the discussion. Meetings adjourned. Thank you. Okay, all in favor? Aye. All opposed? Any abstentions? Happy Thanksgiving, all of you. Thank you, Joe.